Hi, Scorpio. It's me, Alex. See, I got all my cards on the table because I was doing another sign. And I'm like, ooh, let me see what Scorpio's doing. Hi, God. How you doing? I'm okay. Good. Good, good, good. What you up to today, God? Yeah, we had all those tornadoes like you. is busy. Good gracious. God bless those people. Okay, well, look, we see mm, wands. Uh-oh. Scorpio, what are you up to? Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. What's that old church hymn? I can't think of it right now. Where are you going, Scorpio? Something is hard and difficult. I feel like you're trying to stick with it, trying to enforce boundaries. Um, I feel like there's going to be a new wand, right? Added here, a new burden. And you're like, oh, hell no. Somebody's going to be disappointed and there's going to be some sort of distance and lackadaisical approach. Shut down. All right. It's almost like you're resisting some sort of new, exciting thing. But the question is, is it new, exciting to you? Because I got Cupmaster Flex sitting right there. Queen of Swords. I feel like you need to communicate from your heart. That's who the Queen of Swords is presenting to me as today. You need to just speak honestly from your heart. Um, angels are saying there's a fear that you may hurt somebody's feelings and that they may leave. So for some of you, it's almost like you're taking time out to marinate on this communication. I'll just pull these out of my hand, like the whole lump of them. Yeah. The Fool, Three of Pentacles, Chariot, oh, Seven of Wands, oh, Ace of Cups, Two of Cups and Four Swords. So we got the Two of Cups and Four Swords here. Hope you can see that. You absolutely can. Let's just do it like this. Two of Cups and Four of Swords. I really do feel, look at the Ten of Wands. Okay. So right out the gate, even before me really looking at these cards, I really do feel like you're struggling with something, some sort of long-term, maybe job, career, home, contract, school, something that has you bound, right? And I feel like you are building up pressure, pressure, pressure. And I feel like you need to com communicate why you're building up this pressure. And I feel like the reason why you don't want to are nervous about or shying away from resisting build, you know, kind of communicating this is because you're either afraid of getting to, uh, dis you're afraid of getting disappointment, disappointed or hurt, or you're afraid of getting left behind. So I feel like for a lot of you, you're thinking, thinking, thinking of maybe how to convey this message. Whatever this is, 10 of Pentacles, 10 of Wands, it's been building up for a while. Okay. Angels, do you have an, an example? Uh, okay. This is a, a fairly objective and, you know, it's not a dark example, but it's almost like, say you've been working at, you know, working out and going to the gym and you've been going for like a month, right? And you keep saying to yourself, I really need to take some time out and I really need, just need to rest, right? And you're afraid that if you rest, that's going to break your motivation and you're not going to want to go back to the gym, right? That's what this feels like. Like if you say something, you're going to kill the momentum. Ooh, interesting. Burdens related to um, long-term stability, resistance and a new beginning, taking a leap of faith, resisting, trying something new. Here's the new excitement that, you know, three of pentacles, a group may be like, yeah, just do it. Just try it. Just, just, just Scorpio's like, no, <laughs> queen of swords. She's just sitting there like, I wish a motherfucker would. <laughs> a damn sword. And the hand is up. First off, it's the hand that does it for me, right? 
because she's just like, uh huh. Come, I, I wish you would come forward if you dare. Okay. Um, angels just also said to me too, whomever you're dealing with, <laughs> they're intimidated as hell by you, right? And I would be too, in all honesty, where she, you sitting up there with a damn sword talking about come forward. I'm like, uh-uh, I ain't coming. Queen, can you step down here? <laughs> the light is better, right? Um, Queen of Swords and the Chariot. This is focusing on moving forward and honest, and honest communication with hopes to resolve or rectify this situation positively. Okay. The three of cups, the, the disappointment card with the resistant resistance, it just kind of feels like somebody's stuck in their own ways because they're afraid of getting hurt again. Right. You know, you're afraid to tell your mom you don't like her famous, you know, um, um, banana pudding, you know, because you're afraid of hurting her feelings. So what do you do? You keep eating her nasty ass banana pudding, right? And then going home and having a shit. <laughs> Let me move on. So I feel like, you know, I feel like that's starting to bubble up. I feel like um, it's taking its toll on you. For some of you, maybe a trip, maybe a vacation, maybe distance away from this fit situation may reset you. Maybe a conversation with your boo-boo, your friend, your cousin, your dog, your cat, your bird. Um, yeah, four swords here twice is rest. You just need to kind of quote unquote check out because I feel like whatever this is, it's taking its toll. Okay. We opened up with a burden. We're closing with a burden. So unfortunately, I feel like this is something that you're going to have to deal with okay and it, it kind of feels like the only thing that you could do to save yourself to help to help yourself draw boundaries keep your boundaries and every now and then you may have to kind of quote unquote go dark and create some distance between you and this particular person in this particular situation Because they just hurt you too much or they get hurt all the time. This could be somebody you're dealing with who's incredibly sensitive. Like you tell them anything like the wind blows and this person starts to, they get disappointed. Oh, Angel said you're dealing with somebody who gets their hopes up high. Not only that, I don't see Gemini, but I feel like the person you're dealing with is an air sign. Aquarius, um, Libra right there. I don't see Gemini, but I still have another row to put out. So it's almost like you're trying to avoid bursting someone's bubble. So in order for you not to burst, for you not to burst your own bubble, you may just need to take a chill pill or a timeout. Ooh. Ooh, keep going. This is good. This is good. Ooh, six of pentacles. Pentacles. <laughs> I was said pentacles. Um, six of pentacles is charity. You notice that the scales of justice is there. Okay. So it's almost like you're, yeah, look, you got 10 and 10. That's balanced, right? Angels just said, um, 10 pounds of, of feathers to 10 pounds of rocks, which is heavier. And the answer, the philosophical answer is, well, neither because they're both 10 pounds, right? Um, but the physical answer says the fucking rocks. <laughs> so it's almost like somebody's trying to keep the peace, but it, it, it's almost like they're putting themselves in pieces, trying to keep the peace. Because again, you have the seven of wands here. I feel like there could be mirroring. You guys are sweeping things under the rug together. Mm -hmm. Come on, Pentacles, seven of Pentacles. Take a wait and see attitude. See what comes out of this situation. This kind of feels Scorpio, like maybe you just need distance away from a particular situation and take a wait and see approach. Wait and see, you know, maybe somebody is, wants to start out off on a new journey and, you know, you just have to let your person go and see it and just see if they come back. But two of swords is like, hell no, nah, I ain't doing that shit. If they go, they gon' that, that, that's permanent. 
Yeah, this could be almost like somebody too, whether this is you or your lover. I don't think it's your lover. I don't think this is related to you and your love. But it kind of feels like somebody may need to take a time out. Somebody may need to create space or distance in this thing. Somebody is not necessarily seeing the growth, the options, you know, the goals. Mm, Angels just said somebody could be worn out and burned out. Well, there you are. Okay. Queen of Swords, Cut Master Flex, which is Scorpio for me sometimes. The Chariot, okay? This is a uh, travel, distance, a car, um, moving, motion. Queen of Swords, yeah, it's almost like, listen, you can get the hell on, Rob. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> oh, Lord. Nine of Cups. Bring love back into this situation, Scorpio. Look, disappointment. Yeah, you could run the risk of ending something based on principle and wind up hurting yourself, which is a true Scorpio way, by the way. That is so, so normal for Scorpio to do. Look at that, the Nine of Swords, stressed and worried. Where are we going? Here? Okay. There's a lot of love in this situation and that distance is hurting your person or hurting you. So hold the, hold the fuck up. Nine of Pentacles. Thank you. Thank you, Moses. Because I'm like, hold on, hold on. Hold the fucking phone. So on one hand, you have these burdens to deal with. Right? And I feel like Seven of Wands, you're trying to establish those boundaries. Like, look, don't fuck with me when I'm sleepy right as an example okay and i feel like um somebody could be ignoring that or they just keep at it because again 10 wands remember angel said in the beginning somebody's adding on to the pressure the burden okay and i feel like you know you're trying to you're trying to rectify the situation as best as possible you're trying to be honest trying to tell your proof your truth they still don't hear you so it's like you know what I gotta, I gotta end this or I gotta take a break. I gotta move away. I gotta take it. You know what I mean? And then when you, when you, when you create distance, they get hurt. Oh, mm -mm. that don't, that don't make no universal sense. Right? So you're going to pressure me while I'm here and pressure me if I try to move away to relieve myself. No mas. Mm -mm. That's not going to work. Regroup. Pivot. Pivot. That's not going to work. Which is why now I see why you open with the Ten of Wands, you close with the Ten of Wands. Because whatever somebody's suggesting, offering, it's like you trying to get me locked up. <laughs> right? Because at the end of the day, and this is just my personal opinion, you can't continue to apply pressure to Scorpio. Because baby, the stinger, the stinger, the stinger, right? is upright, but it can be down, right? As in, in your ass, right? So I don't know, Cletus, I need, I need, a, I need some more cards. Knight of Pentacles, angels just drew my attention over here. This is continuance, moving on, slow pace. Okay, is that the remedy? Slow things down? Now, here in the outcome position, I got a whole lot of pokey things. I got these swords and I got these wands. I only got two measly cups and the knight of pentacles. So I feel like there has to be a loving resolution as in, babe, listen, you're going to have to let me go or let me, you know, take some time out or, or I'm going to stab you right? <laughs> with my tail. Okay. Um, yeah, there has to be that communication that, listen, I need a break. I need to check out momentarily. Mm. And I feel like if that's communicated correctly and in the right way, yeah, love can prevail. 
I don't know why I did quotes. I like doing quotes. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like love can prevail. It's almost like, listen, this to me is almost like if you love me, you got to let me get the fuck on, right? Or I'm going to sting somebody up in this bitch. <laughs> I, can't. I don't know who reading this. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just here for the jokes, God. Okay, so who do we go to for answers? Moonology? Oh, no. Angel said abstract love oracle somebody made me these cards i love these cards by the way i love 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 them it took me a long time to use them but i love them they're kind of hard to read but we gonna read today so what are what are scorpio's other options or what other information do you have for scorpio yeah scorpio you're at your wits end and i feel like some of you guys are ready to kind of quote unquote jump ship or um you know shut something down completely but the universe is saying listen just regroup regroup pivot pivot you may not need to shut it down permanently maybe you just need you just need to shut down temporarily not only that but i'm looking here at these clusters see how the card is sitting right there but i'm looking at these clusters of pen pentacles which kind of says to me you have a lot invested in this you know ten of pentacles is long-term investment investments Six of Pentacles, again, is trying to keep things balanced. I give, you give. I give, you give. What this card got to say? Uh, you don't like titles because you don't want to control how this works. You don't like titles because you don't want to control how this works. Is that you trying to maintain control? by leaving resetting angel said yes so do you feel like somebody is controlling you and you're feeling weighed down and burdened who child agent angel angels just said a prisoner some of you guys feel blocked and imprisoned maybe by your relationship maybe by your job maybe by your circumstances oh and they keep applying pressure. It's like they just keep adding to the pressure and you're just like, cousin, 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 like, listen, stop. And then over here, you're like, what What I say? You got one more time, Curtis. <laughs> and it's almost like when you draw boundaries, that's what hurts them. Oh, this is a fucked up situation. <laughs> It's almost like you can't be, it's, it, ah, angels just said, it's almost like you're walking on eggshells. That's that imprisonment approach. You feel like you're walking on eggshells or your person does. Ew, this is getting more and more interesting. I know that you're good for me, but I don't think I'm good for you. Ooh, I feel like this could be the other person. Eh, uh-huh. Codependency? My angels just said codependency. Do I have any pages on the table? No, I have a knight over there. Yeah, this, I, and the reason why I was asking about pages is because I was wondering if this was your children or kids, like somebody's just really hanging on to you, hanging from you. And because I have no pages here, this does not look like it's your children, which says to me it's codependence. No one, uh, no one compares to you. I want another chance. That's that yo-yo. Every time you leave, it's like, where are you going? Okay. I'm a people pleaser. Ow. See why I love these cards? See, these cards are like psychological. I promise you, whoever created these cards, mwah, perfecto. Somebody's afraid to lose you, but they are annoying the fuck out of you, making it hard for you to stay. And every time that you try to handle the situation, especially for your benefit, they bitch about that too. They get disappointed about everything. Okay, well, I'm going to go grab these cups. Why? Okay, I'll go grab these ones. Would you show up? <laughs> I can't. I'm going to go. My angels just said to me too, to get from here to here, right? The five, five of cups to get to nine is the four of cups. Four of cups represents being emotionally numb. 
So Scorpio, perhaps, 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 take it as it resonates, you need to implement that Four of Cups energy in your situation. That Four of Cups energy kind of says, reset, reset, reset. Take time out, take a break, um, relieve yourself emotionally. Four, four Swords is here, again, taking a time out so you can come back to this fresh, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and leave it here. Angels are like, but you didn't say who this was. Um, I, cause I don't think this is about anybody, but my dog Scorpio, right? So I feel like this is what you are experiencing internally and, um, yeah. So whatever situation that you're in, it was almost like the universe gave me a blueprint of what is going on inside of you. I don't think that this is specific to a specific Scorpio. I feel like it's going to resonate who, with whom it's supposed to resonate with. And if it does, as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, tell a friend, leave a comment, and I will talk to you Scorps later. I love you. Bye.